Hello and welcome to FUSD News. I'm your host, Rod Allen. Today in San Diego, Del Mar's ban on homeless people will go into effect today, raising the questions only if they knew what to do with their kids. Another man was stabbed in the buttocks last night, leaving his count of victims to 12. The Stop the Butt Stabber GoFundMe page has raised $1 million already, hopefully leading to the arrest of this heinous criminal. Please, Lord. In celebrity news, R. Kelly is being sued by a fifth woman claiming he gave her an SCD unwillingly. He denies the allegations. Come on, Robert. How many times before you learn? International news, there's a royal wedding happening this weekend and nobody cares. Your time has passed. Now for our first story of the evening, we're getting first-hand access of groundbreaking technology being developed right here in San Diego. So for years, Scientists have been updating and developing our transportation from taxis to trolleys and even Ubers. But now we are proud to introduce a breakthrough in automotive technology here in downtown San Diego. Self-driving services or SDS are now bringing their innovative technology to public use. Now let's take a ride into the future. Hello, Charles. What would you like to talk about? Well, that's amazing. You can go anywhere in San Diego without a drive. Doing? What did you guys? Sorry, audience, for the technical difficulties. We'll be right back with that breaking story. For now, let's go to the courthouses, where we have two different reporters covering two different stories. First, let's go to Trey, who's covering the controversial gay tax. It's your boy Trey Robinson. The Vice President of the United States, Mike Pence, is here in beautiful downtown San Diego, where a few moments ago, he reignited the heated debate between himself and the LGBTQ community. Last week, the Vice President announced he was pushing to legalize incest nationwide. Well, today, the Vice President is here in San Diego, where a few moments ago, he defended his main points for a statewide gay tax. I was lucky enough to sit in on the meeting with the Vice President, and I must say he was particularly outraged. He went into detail about his disgust with the unsanitary lifestyles of the homosexuals, how they spread STDs, and I quote, he said, they're sprinkling glitter on the minds of our youth. The vice president went on to say that the last straw for him was seeing what he called a six foot five heathen carrying a fuzzy dildo wearing a purple cheetah print skirt. This led him to create his new slogan if you're noticeably gay, you gotta pay. As for now, the details remain unclear, but Vice President Pence said he plans to enforce this gay tax in cities with high gay populations like San Francisco, Los Angeles, and here in San Diego. This initiative arrives just weeks after his controversial proposal for mandated gay conversion therapy in elementary schools. This proposal was met with a lot of pushback from the LGBTQ community who say that it's unfair intolerant and downright ridiculous. There's a lot going on in San Diego today. I'm sure I have the best story as usual. I'm Trey Robinson, sending it back to you, Todd. Hey, it's all good with me. Let's go to Tracy now. You live, girl. What scoop you got for us? Tracy Robinson here. Before I start, I'd like to thank Trey for his informative piece. Good story, but wait till you hear mine. I'm here outside the courthouse where the city of San Diego just lost a $35 million lawsuit against a woman who claims that she got a disease from one of the bikes that you see right here. Now, a little birdie told me that she got hepatitis. And trust me, Trey will tell you, I know what it feels like to get a disease. Back to you, Todd. Trey, you gave Tracy disease? When? Man, come on now, you, you know these girls are crazy, man. I, I don't know nothing about that. Uh, so, is everything okay? I don't love you anymore. Okay, I don't love you anymore. You got a little ass dick. I don't need you. I don't got a little dick. You got a hippopotamus. <laughs> your your, your <laughs> lips are loose. Ooh. She got a loose ass. <laughs> what am I supposed to do with a loose? Hey, hey, you guys are live. Y'all want to see my? Tell me if my, tell me if I got a little. Tell me if I got a little dick. <laughs>
We'll get that sorted out in a minute here. Now, let's go back to Charles for his story. Hey, uh, Todd, I'm here with Ashley and we're about to end, but as a citizen of San Diego, I have to say, I am impressed with this new technology. So, Charles, what does the future look like for us? This ride's not over, Charles. Wait, what? Ashley, let me out of here. No, Charles. I want to know you more. Hey, what the hell is happening? Is everybody okay? Wait, what? This ride is not over. Uh, Charles, is everything okay? We, uh, cut back to us. Let me out here before you run out of gas. Someone help me. Someone. Hey, Todd! Todd! Somebody help me! Help me! Help me! Wow. Those were some amazing stories. Some real good stuff. We'll be right back with weather and sports. Hey, tell production I'm coming right now. Tell them to get ready with them hands, man.